Socrates once said that if you want to succeed, you need to want it as badly as you want to breathe. When I started Mark III 40 years ago, I wanted to succeed in the worst way. I had a dream that we could do something by putting a team together as opposed to just every trade being an individual. We had a lot of success. I'm very proud of where we took it. I look at our team today and what's the new generation, the new blood, the new leadership, the new employees with the whole team, and I know the sky's the limit. And I know looking forward, it's kind of a mirror of looking back. Looking back was how we took it so far and then didn't know how to pick up the ball and take it further down the field. I could see that if they pick up with the same energy, not they, meaning us, you folks, leadership, all the people out in the field, that there's going to be no stopping. We can take it way, way down the field. I love coming to work. At Mark III, I love the energy and the sense that others feel the same. We come from all walks of life, backgrounds, ages, and experiences. Different trades, skill levels, approaches, and strengths. But we all have a common goal, and that's to change the construction industry. And we should all be so proud of our accomplishments so far. Is the power of one real? Hell yes, the power of one is real. I have seen it. When it clicks, and everyone is working for one another's success, it is tangible. And capturing more of this over time will make us unstoppable. We don't have all the answers. We never will. We just need to believe that our efforts, our decisions, and our innovations are pushing us up our mountain. We need to continue to execute today and think beyond our capabilities for tomorrow. To tell the story of Mark III is to tell the story of the men and women in orange that bleed blue. To tell the story of Mark III is to tell the story of grit, tenacity, and a never-ending drive to build. To tell the story of Mark III is to look around us, to look up, to look forward at what the men and women in this room have built and what we will build. But this story is not over. This is only the first chapter. Our story is yet to be written. To write the story, you have to believe in something I cannot show you or prove. It has not been done before. But what we have to believe is that we can do the impossible and that we will climb this mountain together. We know the trail is steep and the journey is not for the weak. But we know that we thrive with pressure and with a challenge we bear our teeth. Never give up, never give in, always keep climbing, and never, never stop building.